Hi, my name is Sarah Grace and we are the video production class here at ECS. Over the past few weeks, we have conducted interviews with a few of our students who participate in activities and hobbies that go beyond the ECS classroom. We hope you enjoy viewing our Student Spotlight series. I've had an interest in flying ever since I was little. I don't know exactly when, but I've had a fascination with the sky and flying, and there's just something I love about getting to be above everything else and see everything from a bird's eye perspective instead of just walking around and seeing it. I like the sensation of flight and uh, it's just amazing. It's pretty much been my entire life. Um, if I had a favorite type of plane, I'd say the old um, World War II war, uh, warbirds. Um, they're just well engineered and they're beautiful airplanes. I mean today's planes are nice but just uh, they're great looking, great sounding, and they're a major part of history, which is another interesting thing to me as well. I get my license now since I'm 17, and uh, I just had my medical a couple ago to see if I can start working towards my license, and if so, I might start working towards that this. Um, I'd like to become an airline pilot, or even I've considered crop dust. Sounds like a bit of an adventure, flying about five or six feet above the ground and spraying chemicals over someone's crops for a living and for fun too, because that's mainly what I like it for, is for the fun. Um, not really, neither of my parents are pilots and they just, my dad flies a lot for work, but that's about it. Um, I have a younger sister, but she and I have different interests. She wants to be a doctor and I want to be a pilot, so we're a little bit different in that area. I have, I flew twice last year, my first time in a Cessna 172 in Olive Branch, and um, another time in November in a Cessna 152 down, um, downtown. I got to fly over to the Mississippi River and the Pyramid. I can think of, but I mean, it's pretty much just all fun. And one other time I did get to fly when I turned 13 a simulator at FedEx, so that was an experience as well. Oh, cool. um, it's a lot different seeing it from above. Instead of just looking at it, it looks a lot smaller when you're several thousand feet above the ground. And the river's not as big as it looks um, on the ground once you're up in the air. And you can see pretty much all of Memphis when you're up there, and it looks so much better from the air. I can imagine. I've I flew with an instructor twice, and I'd have to definitely fly with a GPS and some training because I feel like I'd end up getting lost somehow because it's all confusing to me right now. Thank you, Ben, for sharing. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed our student spotlight series.